as a tester, we pretty often will need to test websites where you need to enter a credit card. So, because I don't want to enter my own credit card, I check for different websites or different solutions on how I can generate credit card numbers or credit card data. And I came upon this site here. Now, before I show you how this card or this checker works, um, there's a few things which I want to, sh to, to say. Uh, never ever enter your own credit card number or information in these sites. And also never use um, the numbers that you get here in sites except test sites. Okay, with that being said, so in this checker, you can verify if uh, a specific credit card number is valid. And since they have a, a way to verify the credit cards, they also have a way to generate this data. I use both of this valid validation and generation in my tests because I mean, they only give you the credit card number, which is which is okay. I mean, they don't give you any specific number, uh, um, uh, pin codes, or anything else, which is which is perfect. And you can generate different card types or card uh, issuers, so from American Express to Visa, for example. Um, and you just select the amount that you want, and you can bet all of these cards will uh, be valid and you can use them in your testing. I usually will use two or three of them, um, but well, the more you have, the better. I mean, if you want, in the end, you can just write your own uh, credit card generator mechanism. But if you want maybe to know how that is done, click in the video, subscribe and add a comment. Uh, but until then, have a look at these two sites, so the one that you can validate your credit card and uh, generate credit cards for testing purposes only. Yeah. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one and bye-bye.